I love teaching preschool because I feel like I'm setting the foundation. I've been a preschool teacher for 10 years. This is my home. <laughs> That's what I love to do. What letter is that, Nakai? G. Very good, the lowercase g. What I love about teaching is the moment when a child just picks up on something and they're excited about it and they celebrate. Three, four, five, six, seven. That is seven. Here in Camden, we're using the creative curriculum for preschool and teaching strategies goal in all of our pre-K classrooms. I just see it as a huge toolkit that they can use with the children in their classrooms. Teaching Strategies Gold is an assessment that helps us developmentally to find out where our children are and to scaffold their learning. What I love about Teaching Strategies Gold is that there's different color bands and there's different levels, so I'm able to pinpoint exactly where that child is and move them forward. That's amazing, I love it. One of the things that I like most about Teaching Strategies Gold is the fact that it does give me, as a director of the department, the opportunity to see how our students are progressing, our three-year-olds, our four-year-olds, which teachers seem to be having the maximum amount of growth so we can look into some of their best practices and share them out with the larger community. It's now 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock. Since we started using creative curriculum, I've seen personally a world of difference in what's going on in our classrooms. We introduced trees last week. They talked about the leaves and the trees and things that fall from trees. They went home and they came with these Ziploc bags with wet leaves. Creative curriculum allows it to be child directed. So for example, if they're playing with leaves, okay, you're looking at leaves, looking at the shape of leaves, let's make the leaf rubbings. So even though they feel like they're in control at the same time, I'm introducing some new things for them to do. Creative curriculum helps you teach the same thing, the same skill, but at different levels. The integration of both the creative curriculum and the goal helps us to really see how effective our teaching is in the classroom, and that also informs the work that our coaches do, our mentors who go into the classroom. While the teachers are observing, teachers are planning based on the observation, so they're using creative curriculum to plan those activities and be more intentional. It's taken everything to a whole nother level in instruction, in the children's retention, the level of engagement in the classroom. We endorse teaching strategies because our kids learn, individualized, is research-based, is dual language oriented, and then it's helping uh, the whole child and it's helping us assess whether or not they're learning how they're learning socially, cognitively, and in terms also of motor skill development. They are learning through experiences and what you show them every day, not just memorization and intangible ideas. So I feel like when they leave here and they go on to the higher grade levels, and I know because I hear about it from all my parents when they leave, how uh, they are so happy that they learn so much because when they go to kindergarten, they're above the expectations. Early education is essential and critical, and the earlier the better. Teaching Strategies has been able to really address the child as a whole. We know that if you create better conditions for kids, particularly urban kids, that children will succeed and go to college. The hope that I have for the children in Camden City is to continue to see them learn, to become lifelong learners, so that the same excitement that they have in preschool continues on.